Locked. Alright. Should be good. Alright. Thanks, guys. Thank you, Brandon. You got everything? I think we may need to have yeah. one more. I think so, too. Watch your hip, watch your hip here in the door. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's kind of there. slanted and yeah, sloped. Yeah, we can do that one more time. We need to go up one more for the load. Alright, ready? One, one, two, three. I think we're walking now. Can we go up? I feel Is like we went up maybe. Oh no. Yeah, I don't know, know if I did. Let's try it again. Yeah, more. I think we still need to go I think we go gotta up. go higher on this end, so if yeah. we can get one more person around here. Yeah. You're in the middle. Nick. Hold on a second. You go around. Cameron's coming over here. Oh, okay. One, two, three. There, Mark. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. We're higher now. Get that angle. All right. Yeah. All right. Watch your elbows. All right. Ooh, it's sort of humid out here. Very. It's been raining all morning long. Uh, let's go straight and then kind of get them turned this yep. way. Nick, don't you go around inside right. the truck and guide it in? Lock. Lock. There's sun oh, wait, one person to grab. beating down on me. Uh, uh, right here. Don't we'll let the in. sun beat down on yeah, me. Can, yeah, Don't let the, the sun. The Although okay. I Nick, shade myself. Two, oh, you got me. Here's the sun. Oh, there we go. What do you need, Nick? We're right in. We're in? Yep. Okay. We can lock over here just a little bit more. Which way? Toward you a little bit. It doesn't want to. Yeah, uh, it's not one to latch on. Quite this pin. It's as far as we're going. So. Yeah, that's all that's the way it? in. We're yeah. like perfectly yeah. located. In. Get some of the push it's right there. This hip. There we go. Okay. Thanks, guys. Yeah. You're about to You can have one. Obviously, y'all again a little bit. <laughs> yeah. See ya. Thank you. Appreciate it, guys. Hey, Jeremy. You okay with blood pressure on your wrist? Sure. And there's one matter. Um, it doesn't matter what side. Doesn't matter what side. You know what? I think I might be better on the right side. Better on the right, better on the right side? I, yeah, better on the right side. You guys good or you need some help? You guys? Okay. Yeah, how about that? <laughs> you feel like you're getting enough air? Yeah, I think so. If I put this right here, yeah.
feeling dizzy or lightheaded at all? No. Nice air conditioning in here. Feel good? Yeah, it feels great. Yeah, we have one of the nice trucks today. Yeah. With it being so humid out. Yeah, your clock is wrong though. Oh, they all are. We got to change the battery. No, we just don't worry about them much. Not all of our trucks have them. Yeah. We mainly just use our watches and then we could use our monitors and everything. Oh. Uh. So what are you going over to the DuPont area for? Well, originally I was complaining about a piece of um, gum that had broken off my upper mouth and was pressing against my denture plate, causing me a great deal of pain yeah. when I would bite down and chew on something, and I was just totally miserable. And uh, then I was in a verbal altercation with a new activity person who was being disrespectful to me. And, um, and so I, um, the verbal altercation caused my upper plate to bang against the piece of gum causing it to bleed and then I was bleeding from the mouth and then when the bleeding stopped um, and it wasn't as much as it was and um, then I was rinsing with a mouth rinse with the denture out of my mouth so it would maybe do something to that piece of gum well now that piece of gum is almost gone and uh, no more pain can't even see it anymore until unless you of course take my denture plate out you know and then you'll see it. but um, actually um, after they had pulled my bottom teeth out so much ago uh, they told me that a new set of dentures would be ready in June. So I had to wait four months for June to come around and then I'd get new plates. And then I would use these as a spare because this denture plate is from 2005 and there's already a line underneath going the whole length of it which could show that it could break in half um, on that line and uh, there are places on the plate that you could see metal going through including on that line so already we have exposed metal on the plate so it's not really healthy for me to wear this plate anymore. So that's what I was looking forward to getting new dentures and uh, use these as a spare. But the set never came in, and so 
and they keep talking about my being refitted for the new denture new denture set especially since I have lost weight and especially in my mat in my face and they said that um, if I lose weight in my face it would affect the way the denture would sit and uh, it was only like maybe a couple of times that I felt the denture move in my mouth but other than that it's generally in there and it ain't moving okay. you know so um, so originally they were going to remove that piece of gum and um, and refit me but now that gum is practically gone so it's likely that um, it'll refit me for new for the new dentures that's that's my guess on it yeah, so I heard it's not gonna take too long here oh that's good that's very good because I, but I probably will miss bingo at two o'clock But if I if I do get back <laughs> before you know three thirty, I would like to get back into bingo. You know, and it is going to be a short appointment. Yeah, because it sounds like we're actually going to be waiting around for you to be done to take you back. Oh, good. So usually that means they're going to be pretty short. Hopefully, just a quick. Yeah, sort of like a consultation. Yeah, I think they're just going to be looking and sizing. And yeah, go yeah, there. yeah. Well, that's good news to me because I want to go to bingo today. You know, and so I'm very happy about that. And that's why I got dressed. Not only that, so I can do my therapy. Oh, this is a new way of going. Where are we? We are, I'm guessing this is Flint. Oh! Never mind. Yeah, well, we're on Auburn. We're on Auburn. We're about to go around. So we're kind of going back way. Stay away from the big roads. Nah. Auburn. I'm trying to think where Auburn is. Gonna go in the back way into DuPont. Look that way. Yeah, it's gonna pull us right alongside DuPont area. Okay, so is it parallel to Clinton? Is that what this is? Yes. It, because I I know Fort Wayne is sort of like a grid. Yeah, until you get downtown and it's just ridiculous. Yeah, well, with with the construction and stuff. You mind if I take a listen to your lungs here? Oh, not at all. Awesome, thank you. Cough up a lot of phlegm. A lot of phlegm? Yeah. How often do you have that uh, <coughs> trach you care for? Do they have daily? The, the, the trach? Yeah. How long have I had it? Yeah, how long have you had it? Since 2012. It's 2012? Alright. Yeah. Take pretty good care of it? Yeah, pretty much. It is overdue for a change. Overdue for a change? Yeah, it's like, yeah. Um, it's almost two months overdue. You have any pain right now? 
Uh, no. No. Normally in my pain in my, uh, in my back and my knees, but um, normally otherwise, uh, you know, no. You know. Doing all right. Okay. Yeah. I hope. So there's E and T up at Dupont. I didn't know there was E and T at Dupont. Yep. Looks hey like guys, I'm gonna go let them know where it is so they can get the proper moral. Alright, sounds good. Uh, uh, sounds like we're just gonna chill here for a little bit, uh, kinda get a heads up and make sure we go where we're going. Let's go. Okay. Right. We've taken you around before, haven't we? What do you mean? We've transported you before? Oh, yeah. yeah so you understand the signatures? Yeah, I understand the signatures. Two signatures. I'm gonna get those two while we're waiting. I'm gonna take this off of your finger. Alright, thank you. Alright, here you go. Well, we're gonna wait back here just for a few. She's gonna get tell them we're here because they're gonna open uh, the doors for us and we'll mm -hmm. be on in there. Sounds good. How old are you, sir? 55. Uh, I'm gonna hit that button. It makes a really loud, obnoxious noise up there. What? Oh, gotcha. When we back up, there's a little security button that they make us do. Oh. The BB doesn't bother me. Oh, uh, not this one. There's the one that goes up to the front that's super loud. We can't really hear really? it from back here. What? Well, does it go? Eh, 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 eh. Yeah. It basically eh, says that yeah. you should have a spotter. Yeah, yeah. I'll be right back. We just need to get ourselves lined up. Sounds good. Yeah, yeah. I don't think I've ever encountered a buzzer like that. Actually, that would be more like a klaxon, wouldn't it? it a what? That would be more like a klaxon, wouldn't it? Possibly. You know, if it's that loud and it's mm -hmm. uh, has that uh, frequency or, or, you know... definitely does his job of letting you know it's there. Yeah. You know, it's the kind where, you know, a, a dome light spitting and red and white and mm -hmm. and it's spitting and it's alarming, you know. What happened here on your left leg? Um, good question, I think. Uh, I, I think I hit on something. And it started to bleed. Right. Yeah, you have pretty frail skin down there. Uh, and neuropathy. Neuropathy, okay. And bad circulation. I always thought that was just dry blood on the inside of my skin. So all you gotta do is just open up my skin, clean the dry blood off, close it back up, and uh, then you'll see normal color. But, of course, I was told that that would be impossible. And that's not the case. Yeah, that's not how that works. I know, I know. But that's what comes to mind. Take those two in the back of the 
van. There okay. are two ramps that are strapped yep. in. I think the doctor's going to come out here to you, Jim. Really? Which would be awesome. Yeah. <laughs> so, she's going to go check, but I think that's what's going to happen. Oh, okay. Hey, that saves a lot of time. Super quick, Jim, if they'll come do that for us. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to go work on getting those locks back in. Right. And then again, I might make me go. <laughs> when, when we get back, Jim, are you going to go back to your wheelchair or back to your uh, Back to the wheelchair and uh, then most likely uh, down in Bingo. Okay. What time is it now? So, 1.50. It's about 1.50. Ay, ay, I'm probably going to miss some bingo. I get there for some of it, though. Yeah. If, this is, if, if the doctor's just going to jump on board and check you out, then... He did pretty well. Yeah. It'll be a quick moving process. Yeah. Yeah, everything should always be in this child's conversation. I thought the appointment was at 110. Do you guys generally come on these type of things? Yes. I know sometimes band camps was a lot of that. So I do. Um, they prefer at least the soup here or reason why it's more familiar. Randy really prefers the soup here. Understandable. Facilitated. Yeah, just to make sure everything goes safely and smoothly.
she's more or less standing by waiting for the bill. Yeah, she can go both of me. Looks like the sun's returned. It's peeking in and out of clouds. Yeah. yeah. It's going to rain all evening. It's going to rain all evening? Oh, yeah. Still doing okay in there? Yeah, I'm still doing good. Okay. Um, I haven't looked at the queue in a while. That would surprise me based off of what we were told. There were only like one bed in like each unit that was available for anybody. Yeah. There were a couple of days last week when we called and said, I'm going to say that we have 54 discharges today. I mean, they're not all ambulance discharges. Well, did you bring anything with you? Like a uh, med list or anything like that? No. All right, so I'm going inside, right?
You guys got one on each side and one in the middle? Here we go. Going, into, ready? going yeah. into that sun. I'm feeling it. Don't let the sun. Actually, no, now the sun's behind the clouds. You're watching back here. See, now the sun is behind the clouds. Well, I asked that the sun not beat down on me, and so the sun is behaving itself. <laughs> it's nice to have. It's nice to see the sun behaving itself. Yeah, I know. I felt that too. It went into, got into the ambulance. We'll go in this side door. Should be a straight shot. We might need to come up this way. Yeah, yeah. Still hanging in there, dear? Yep. All right. Kind of a process, isn't it, for you? Yeah, it's brand new this place. Yeah. <laughs> I helped you guys. Here. Yeah, you did. Yeah. Should be going straight through there, Nick, and making a left. Much elbows. Yeah. Sorry, 